Good morning, welcome to M Drives and welcome to day three at the Nürburgring. So I got up early because the truck opens at eight and my tires are pretty cold and um, low on pressure. So I have to drive them a bit to get them to the right pressure, which is perfect for the truck. So as you can see, uh, there is a Nürburgring um, castle behind me. Uh, the two Porsches now, are now gone, but we still got nice CSL here. Um, so yeah, I'm going for a quick drive. It's very quiet here still, uh, but yeah, won't be uh, anymore when I start my car. So let's go for a short drive and then I'm hopping on the track. I thought it might be a good idea to stop at the YouTube corner as at this time of the day it should be empty and it will present a good photo opportunity. And it was. Jumping on track, I'm gonna have to check my tire because I've got, I think, still some stuff from yesterday in it, or it's a new stone which is stuck in a thread of the tire. It's making horrific noise. Well, we're going through the tunnel, so it would be rude not to. So, we are going for our first lap today. GT3 RS MR, oh my god. Some serious stuff around me, I will have to run away to the side. I bet this thing will just shoot off and I won't see it after 10 seconds. I'm meant to take it easy. 
easy already. Ah. Hello. Ready? Yeah. Have you been no. Quick cool down and it was time to go for another lap. So heading out for another lap. I've got only two laps left. A couple of mates went out for a lap as well. So hopefully we will see them on track. I'm going to really try to do a bit quicker lap this time, despite all the shaking and check the wheel nuts and they are all fine. That was my worry when everything was shaking. But we'll see how it goes. Despite getting a lot of shaking during braking, I was determined to have a good lap.
driving behind my mate in his 1M felt absolutely amazing. For a moment I almost felt like Chris Harris when he drove both cars on the track in one of his videos. Obviously, much slower version of Chris Harris. So yes guys, this is it, end of lap, end of the final lap at the Nürburgring this year. It was absolutely an amazing experience really. Um, we are heading to the YouTube corner now to enjoy uh, watching cars, hearing engines for another hour or so before uh, we set off back to UK. On our way to the YouTube corner. These bad boys, the car seats, very, very nice. So, welcome back from the YouTube corner. Um, we've seen actually two accidents a moment ago. 
Uh, they just happening all the time. We must have seen about five tow trucks with cars on them, uh, different types of cars. So uh, yeah, it's just uh, very, very busy today. Uh, I think when we looked at the uh, billboard earlier, uh, they were showing about 250, 260 cars on the lap, on the on the track. So very busy. Uh, but yeah, unfortunately, it's that time when uh, we have to set off uh, back home. So I'm gonna get some petrol in a moment, and we're slowly going to uh, drive towards uh, Rotterdam. Gonna probably stop for lunch somewhere, and um, I'll see you on the boat. Last short blast through the Eiffel Mountains before we got to the motorway, which took us back to Netherlands. Once again, I got to the point when you realized that this is the beginning of the end of your trip, which is a bit of a sad moment. However, remember, there is always another one. And yes, I already planned something later this year, so watch this space. The journey back was very calm, we had a nice pine, relaxing evening and a good sleep. Next day we woke up back in UK and we continued the drive to get home. Once again, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this little series. Please make sure you like and subscribe and I'll see you shortly in the next one. Goodbye. Do widzenia.